What's up, y'all? You know what time it is. Uh, it's nighttime. We got in our workout this morning. I was super excited today. I hit 3.15 twice. But here's the fucked up thing. <laughs> I got injured. Now, let me tell you how stupid this is, okay? So I was lifting heavy weight, doing my thing, power clean today, power snatch, did my thing. was like, mm, feeling good. Left to go to Toys R Us to go shopping for my kids and for my daughter's birthday tomorrow. And I tried to pick up like this little box, nothing crazy, like maybe 15 pounds, and tweak something in my back. And I don't even know what it is. And it hurts like a bitch. I have to stay in like like a, a specific like position <laughs> to not feel pain. But fortunately, after testing things a little bit more, um, I realized that <laughs> I should still be able to squat tomorrow. So we should be good. Hold on, let me switch my damn hands. But anyway, so other than that, I think it's stupid as hell that I got injured off of some dumb shit. I mean, at least if I would have got injured working out, I would have been excited. But picking up a 15 pound box, dude, stupid. And like the position that, <laughs> that it hurts is like, it's not on my spine or anything. It's just like on my muscle, like underneath, I don't know. It's just on my back, like top right. It's fucking weird. But anyway. Today I wanted to talk to you guys a little bit about simplicity. Um, you know, in life, like, we, we we got this issue where we just overcomplicate shit. <laughs> you know, we're like, oh, this is what I want to do with my life. And then we just like, oh, let, let's think of one million steps that we would have to complete in order to be successful at this task. But I feel like, you know, I've been thinking about it a lot, and I feel like it's, like, one of the biggest, biggest uh, hindrances to success because... You know, the big thing is all you have to do, literally, if you want to do anything, and this is huge with the, you know, the SBA, the S-ball, you know, stop being a little bitch, is just do it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, it's so simple. It's like, you know, we like to overcomplicate every damn thing, but the reality is, is like, for instance, you want to start a business? Go start that motherfucker. You want, you want to get a girlfriend? Go talk to some chicks. I mean, it's just really simple. It's just, like I said, we like to add all of these extra curricular requirements right like oh man if i'm gonna start a business i gotta do this 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 and this i gotta be a master of this i gotta do this i gotta do that and before you know it you don't even start so i feel like and this is what i'm learning like in this whole process you know of becoming a better me is the easiest way the easiest way to make shit happen is as soon as you think about it and you want to do it just fucking do it don't think about how don't think about why don't think about what just do it and i'm learning this a lot like especially like in my heavier lifts like when i get to a, a position where it, it's weight that i'm normally not comfortable lifting and then i the first thing i start doing is thinking about all the reasons why i can't do it my wrist position is off my foot position is off this feels funny i don't even know right and you know the bitch comes out <laughs> and then I, I i miss the weight but i notice after i set up and i just lift the weight without thinking about shit but like lifting the weight it gets done and I'm feeling like this principle or this practice really applies to everything in life. So, if there's anything that y'all want to do, and I'm going to apply this to everything that I do, if there's anything that y'all want to do, just do it. Don't ask no questions. Don't, don't waste no time. Just do it. But anyway, I'm going to go lay my ass down. I got to eat some more. I got about another 30 minutes so I can kill another, I don't know, 1,300 calories-ish. Nah, so I'm going to go ahead and hear me. Then I'm going to lay my ass down. And uh, hopefully my fucking back feels better tomorrow. I told my body, I was like, look, dog. You heard all the fuck you want. You're still working out tomorrow. So you might want to get over it quickly. <laughs> but anyway, I love you guys, man. You guys have a wonderful day. And uh, I'll see y'all tomorrow. Peace.